let's talk about technology and gear lust. I'm gonna first start by stating that yes, I am totally aware that I am in front of a backdrop of a huge amount of gear. And that's just kind of my intention here um, because it is, it is a bit ridiculous, right? But when I started, I had a very rickety old PC computer. This was back in like 2005, I think I got this computer. And I got Logic 5.5, which was the last version of Logic for PC. And I really stretched it with that setup. I had a little bundle of plugins that I'd collected. Some were legit, some were not. Um, I've sorted out my plugin karma now, so I'm all good. No worries there. And um, yeah, you know, I, I really didn't have much when I started. Had this computer, I had these few plugins, I had some samples that were, you know, being shared around amongst producer friends. Um, but there wasn't much knowledge being shared back then. Um, everyone kind of had their ways of doing things and they were pretty secretive and guarded and, uh, you know, someone getting a certain sound was sort of like their private life. It's not like today where there's just a million and one tutorials on how to do everything. And I feel like that was kind of a good thing because it really got the individual focused on this mission of like, all right, I've got to crack the code of sound. I've got to figure it out for myself. So you would put yourself in the studio for eight hours a day, five days a week, and you would just focus on sound and exploration of, of sound. And for me back then, it was just this little setup and I literally used like Waves Renaissance EQ on everything. I used Waves Renaissance reverbs on all my reverbs. And we're talking about the first two Merkaba albums and at least the first three Kalia Scintilla releases. You know, all that stuff was made on the most budget setup ever. Uh, so that's I'm, the reason I'm telling you this is to put it in perspective. You don't need all this stuff ultimately to create music that comes from your heart. You just need a few good tools and you need to learn how to use them. 